Hi everybody, I'm doing another unboxing. This is a, a, a wish, wish, I can't talk. This is a extremely rare wish list plant that I've wanted for a long time. Um, Sorry, this box is kind of large. Uh. Oh no! It's upside down. Shoot! Uh. It's upside down. Oh no, I hope his leaves aren't broke off. person should have really put this side up. Oh gosh. Oh, oh I feel leaves. Oh geez. Okay, did he attach him to something? Maybe you should have attached. Maybe you should have attached the the bottom, not the top. Come on, people! Oh my gosh! Is I need to get this guy out before he dies and I cry. Okay, he taped him. To the top. Yeah. The guy I got him from, he's not the greatest at wrapping up plants. Uh, as you can see. I mean. Oh, geez. Come on. Let's. Okay, poor guy, sitting in there. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, here we go. Oh, he's got dirt. Let's hope there's not a bunch of broken stems. There's a broken stem. Shoot. One broken stem. Oh gosh. I paid entirely too much for this plant for it to be like this. So this one's torn, this one's broken, this one's broken. And I paid a lot of money for this guy.
kind of soil is that? I got a plant, I paid like, very expensive, this was expensive, and he's got four broken stems. There is a leaf growing in, so that's, that's a good thing. But I don't know what the, I don't know why he's in such heavy soil. This soil is so freaking heavy. Oh man. See, that one's broken. That one's broken. This one's broken. This one's broken. Well, you know, that kind of sucks, but you know, it is what it is. Well, for what it's worth, he's got a beautiful leaf. I don't know how long that's going to last. I'm probably going to have to replant him because he, look at that soil. It's, it's, it's like something I'd put in my uh, garden. Looks like there's a new leaf coming in. I'm hoping that guy will. But I'm gonna have to replant him because that, that is just terrible soil. This is the same person I got my Clarinerviums from, and um, yeah, they were in soil like this. And then I have a Clary Clarinervium Faustino, and that one is still in heavy soil but it's not as heavy um, I wonder if I could tape it if it would oh well well that's my unboxing unfortunately not a good one sometimes you Sometimes you get screwed. And this time I got screwed. Okay, here I wanted to show you. It's a couple days after I unboxed her. It's my silver dragon. Um, still alive. Now I'm kind of worried I should have put her in better soil. I don't know. Well, it doesn't. I think she'll be alright. 
she looks like she's growing a leaf. Um, thanks to Suzette. Um, I put scotch tape on the on the stems that were bent. So they're holding on. So it's hold she's holding on and and I, I have her in the grow tent, so I, I imagine that's why that leaf is coming out so fast. There is something going on here. I don't know what that is, but I will keep you updated. That might be a baby coming out. I'm hoping. So yeah, she's still alive. I did message the guy and of course he told me that the reason he did not send her with no pot was because to avoid stress of shipping. Well, I think putting a plant in a pot with very heavy soil and not securing it and having all the stems get broken is more of a shock to a plant than repotting. I mean, I have plants, I think the one I got from Thailand wasn't potted and that one did fine. There was no shocking, but yeah, I just wanted to update um, at the end of the video how she's doing. And I'm gonna put her back in the grow tent Hopefully she'll be okay. So I will probably get, be giving him negative feedback or something. I, I just, you know, he should have secured the pot. You don't send heavy soil with a plant and not secure the pot. Because the mailman doesn't know which way. He didn't even put anything on there that said this, this is up. This is still the beautiful box. Nothing says this way up. Nothing that's fragile, nothing. He just stuck her in a box and shipped her. I'm just hoping for the best for her. Because she was expensive. Okay, that's it. I just wanted to let you know how she's doing.